and I absolutely love it. Sleep, that's exactly how I feel. <laughs> that's exactly how I was feeling. I was like, yeah. Sleep always looking so cool. Always looking <laughs> confident. Loses bracket action time for him, though. He's playing a matchup that I think he'll probably be comfortable in. Uh, it's mm -hmm. one of those ones where really the projectiles of Arya, the properties on her moves, really help her out in yeah. this matchup. They deal with Hisako well. She has a tough time in the neutral. If she can knock this character down, great. But getting there is so difficult. And you're going to see that, I think, a lot in this matchup. All right. Yeah, calls bold assist there. And this is what it's going to be like. Lots of floating above Hisako, not allowing her to go with consistent anti-airs, forcing the mix-ups. All right, a back throw early. This could be the, this could be the start. No break in the beginning. Uh, nice whip punish there. Yeah, Arya has a fantastic whip punish. For She just has kind of like an ooh. That was a good mix-up try, but she has a great back dash. Moves really far away, allows her to really set things up and whip punish with crashing medium kick. Short combo, that should be the body. It's an early start for Storm here in this matchup. But that's the thing is that it, it, it can just add up, right? It's one of those matchups where you can just get clipped over and over and over. Yeah, and I mean, Sleep is in his, his blade body right now, and yeah. he's going to be able to definitely put some pressure on Hisako right now. And then you see Hisako just sitting there eating these jumps over and over. If he tries to do anti-air counter or something, you can just do jump medium kick, right? Yeah. There's so many options that you have. Trade combo takes the sweep. Okay, heavy linker, it's a break. Sleep really winding and trying to grind this life bar back towards even. Yeah, check after him. Storm just forced to deal with it. He could have tried a shadow counter maybe on the knees, but didn't go for it, so now he's moving in. A regular jump that time, and yeah, jumping medium kick. He's gonna get through. See, oh, we went oh, for the counter break again, yeah. and then Sleep just jumped back. He didn't get a punish on it. Shadow again gets opened up by the knees, medium, and then the shadow after. Good break. Sleep didn't want to go for the counter breaker, lands with the uppercut. Very close here. Dang, he got the counter. Big break. He had a level four on that. That would have been massive damage. Oh, he tried the low counter again. And Sleep, of course, is waiting this out. He's got to play this matchup slow. It's a grind. Yeah, I like the fact that, you know, Storm has just a little bit of life left, but he's still playing it really, really patiently right now. He has to. It's yeah. one of those matchups. Uh-oh, this is big. Light, he broke it at the end. He saw the strength, the uh, the record there. Jump medium kick again. Whiffs the uppercut. Instinct activation to keep himself safe. Whiff cancel on the parry. Jumping, looking for that low. Yeah, yeah gets that last bit of life. And this is a grind. Isaku has got to move in here and make something happen. It's just going to be chip. Mix-ups over and over. You see, not even giving an opportunity to counter there. And yeah, that was going to be a nice stroke combo from Sleep. Good break. Yeah, every time that Storm has tried to counter, too, it, it hasn't really worked in his favor. Sleep just chipping away here. 30 seconds left. He's got that blade assist. Early jump, medium kicks again. He's got projectiles, too. The assist, he had to respect it. Baited the throw, but didn't get anything off that jump, and this is big. It was a medium linker. He gets locked out on it. This is a lot of damage on this body, although it's probably still... No, the shadow. It's going to be close. Chilling. Not just yet. living. Meaty. Just backs off. This is good for Sleep. He just gets to keep playing this game. Yeah, Sleep try still to keep alive that... on this body, but yeah. 16 seconds to go. He's just going to try to get all the chip he can, although it's not too much. Man, he's just got to walk forever. Okay, caught him. This is a little bit of damage on that. Like 13%. Oh, yeah, Storm has got to get in there now. Nine there seconds. He sweeps the leg. This is scary. Yeah, Storm I... has the health lead, but there's eight seconds left. Storm has instinct as well. There Low you counter. go. Gonna get the counter. This is gonna be it. Yeah, keeps the combo super, super short. He just doesn't want to get hit again. Run for his life. Oh, no. Activates the instinct. He went in for it. Does Can he, he have enough do time? Enough yeah, I don't yeah. know if he has enough time with a blade body. Two seconds on the clock. One second left on the clock for oh. sleep. If he, oh, the time out. If he could have opened him up and got that ultra, he would have killed him, but yeah. he just didn't get the opportunity. And that's exactly how you have to play the match, right? You have to just wait, wait, wait as Isako for so long. Take those moments, force the timeout. I mean, we saw what Isako TJ looked like, right? A very right. explosive match. But in this matchup, much slower. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, Storm is handling it really well right now. Got a good life lead right at the start. Yeah, Simply hard does. knockdown. Ender, I think, is a great choice. You really want to cage Arya. Don't let her escape. Sleep getting some distance now. Blade body for the anti-air. Ooh, comes out in the front with a crescendo. Good block. 
trying to get that far jump heavy punch. Oh, he went for the shadow counter so late though. It's gonna be a punish. About half the KV bar is full already. Yeah, so only a level three. Empty jump low again. He's ready for it. Yeah, Storm, he's doing a good job of surviving, but he needs to do much more, you know what I mean? It's, it's hard to do, but uh, it's gonna be shadow here. Yeah, I mean, he has to take a big risk, right? Exactly, and that's what he gets for yeah. it. The shadow right after to cash things out. And it's a great first light bar for sleep. That's really how this matchup needs to go. Let's see if he can end up taking this body, though. He was scared of something on Wake Up. He doesn't go for the uppercut. Heavy Linker gets broken. Storm trying to clip him. He's just going to he float above. Yeah. Away. Yep. Shotgun knee for the punish. Gets to the other side again. Man, sleep. He's just, he's capitalizing on what little life this body has left. Surprised he hasn't switched down yet, but maybe he just favors the control in his body. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely working in his favor right now, right? Caught him heavy, and he looks for the break. Loses the body, but he's got such a lead. Yeah, he has two full life bodies right now. He hasn't even built an instinct yet. All right, that, no, it doesn't get in there. The knees blow it up, and the heavy linker gets broken. Dash cancels back. Storm's gonna need to make something really big happen right now. Let's see if he can do it. Can he open him up? Oh, this is a big chance for sleep here. Yeah, he thought the counter was going. Oh, he, he just went right into it. He didn't have to do that, but this is a big opportunity now for Storm. Oh, missed the oh, air on Rio's on it, look like, and he's gonna lose the game for it. Sleep takes game two. Yeah, and it's so unfortunate, right? Because in that scenario, if you land that TK air on Rio Zani, hits counter hit, you get a you lockout. Get a, yeah. you, you might kill the body, right? And if that happens, this is a doable match, right? We've got a match that looks like it's winnable. But in that situation, drops for Storm. Comes down one apiece. We go to character select. Back to character All select. Right. Take some time. Compose yourself a little bit. Yeah, yeah. he also, I don't, I don't expect that we'll see a character switch, but yeah. might take some time to think about it here. Yeah, it's one of those I mean, matchups that can be tough. And it's real draining the player, right. right? It just takes yeah. so long. Win or lose, the match takes forever. Yeah, I mean, when you're watching that match, there's a lot of of patience and yes. back and forth that's just like kind of really just slow paced. So uh, imagine that when you're playing it, right? Yeah, and you know that as the Hisako player, you're the one who has to approach. Right. And it's so draining. It's yes. just wait, wait, wait. Get that one opportunity, you get broken. You're like, yep. oh, man, how am I going to get back in? And we saw that happen multiple times, too. Exactly. When he did get those opportunities. So that even that just feels so much more demoralizing, right? Yeah, so we end up a one apiece here. Loser's action. Loser of this will go out of the tournament in fifth place here at Combo Breaker. Not get one of those fancy discs that hmm. you get for winning the tournament. It's going to be Hisako again. Uh, he didn't switch it up here. And tries the air-to-air -air early, and now he's just stuck, right? You got to deal with the shotgun knees. You got to deal with the pressure from the uh, the zoning assist as well. The float mix up, yeah. Yeah, this is this is gonna be tough for Storm. He needs to figure something out here. Yeah, floats again, and he just waits. And Storm is in such a bad position. Yeah. He doesn't want to risk the counter because he's afraid that he'll just go for uh, the jump medium kick instead, right? So right. he's just waiting it out. Yep. Or even just empty jump low off the floor. Yeah, and we've seen Sleep already blow up a counter attempt a few times in that last game too. Yeah, went for the shadow counter there, expecting another button afterwards. It didn't work. Pressure after this, too, and Sleep just runs away. He just chips him. He gets what he comes in for and just runs. It's such a strong strategy against this character. Ooh, trying to get that air to air, trying to chase him down. All right, finds that uh, down fierce. Nothing off of it, though, and there it is. That long range punish. Ooh, other side with the crescendo. He's got the assist. Comes down in front, but he had a heavy break, you know. It's a heavy move. Went for the command throw. He's out of there, and Sleep just runs for it. What a heavy kick ant here. Oh, man, this and that's going to be the life bar. Yeah. yeah. Losing the instinct, losing his life bar, and Sleep with an even bigger lead in this game. And you know he's just going to run for it. Just play it nice and slow. Yes. No reason to overcommit. Right. He hit the drone, which is nice. Yeah, a, bit, a little bit of damage on yeah. that, but you need so much more. Yeah, Sleep doesn't need to really take any risks here. Exactly. You see him floating away too, right? Yeah. He floats away so that he doesn't have to commit too much on the offense. Empty low. Didn't get a combo off of it, but all this damage just adds up time and time again. All right. Mix up here. Jump in. Try to bait the throw. Oh, Baits the counter baits, that yeah. time. All right. Finds the low medium king. Nothing off of it. Storm just cannot get anything going. 
Medium linker, he's locked out. This is big damage, not enough to kill. But it's, oh, it, it is, is enough to kill, damn! Yeah. yeah, sleep definitely controlled that match. Well, yeah. I don't know what you do here. So yeah. I, I, he's so lost, right? There's, so, there's no moment where he looks comfortable. Even the moment where he's like, all right, he's been doing delayed float, mm -hmm. falling heavy punch, like five times in a row. He's like, I'm gonna counter it. He just waits up there, empty jump low. You're like, oh my god, why? <laughs> just give me the counter for once. Yeah, it's tricky too, the more you play into that match too, right? In the beginning, maybe you can take a little bit more risks. Yeah. But then you start getting into that red life. You're yeah. like 50% into that. You're like, oh, I don't want to even touch a button now. You're so scared, yeah. right? Like, what am I supposed to do here? Yeah, yeah, it's tough. You end up just turtling up, and it's one of those matchups where if you don't get going real early, yeah. or if you don't find a big opportunity right. near the end, you're in so much trouble. And even if you kill a body, it resets point blank, and then he just run away from you, right? So it's really hard. You have to force that mix up. Yeah, I, I feel like Storm definitely needs to get that one big opportunity, get that hard knockdown. It's a one it, chance kind of match. Right. Yeah. And you need to really hope that you get it, and not only that, but actively look for it. You have to understand the kind of match you're playing, you know? And even if you do, it's still tough. Two one now in the favor of sleep, and this this is one of those matchups where if you're storm, it's the exact character matchup that you don't want to run into, right? Yeah, absolutely. It's that sort of it's that player and character matchup that you don't want to run into. Somebody who's so willing to play slow, willing to play really controlling a style. It's tough to beat. All right, early crouching heavy punch, a lot of damage, but look at that, he just escapes with that back dash. There it is. Has the blade assist as well. Float. Oh, nice to get some. Doesn't have uh, Wrath to get the, the recapture, though. All right. This is already a big star for Storm. I feel like he's got more damage on this life bar than he got last time. Jump cross up. There's a tick throw. So close to taking this body. Chip will do it. Yeah. Nice. And he got him anyway with a button. This is a really good start. Yeah, this is exactly absolutely. what you need. Yep. He's got the momentum going. Let's see what he can do in this next round. Well, back to full screen already. Storm just standing comfortably over there, not making any risks. Yeah, that jumping medium kick is a problem in this matchup. Hits the drone, just a nice little chunk of damage there. Mm -hmm. You can see it in the top right there. Sleep lost a little bit of life on that zoning drone, which you see so much. All right, there's a punish. Breaks the light doubles, man. And if you're Storm, you got to get in real quick here. Oh, he tried to shadow counter. Gets the activation so that he can keep up the offense. Oh, he got the shadow counter. It's going to catch him on the start of the drone. Reset. See what he does. Caught him jumping a couple of times. There, instinct activation and the backdash again. Such a strong backdash, especially while in instinct. Sleep able to really control the pace here with this instinct mode. Those Over drones all that protecting. Empty low again goes into the shadow shotgun knee. Takes that knockdown again. Has Blade with the assist. Such a powerful combination. And, and he just opens him up low. And Sleep is in a really strong position now. Even though he used that instinct up, uh, he, he's looking pretty solid here. He's got such a big advantage. And he goes to the zoning body. Yeah, that's going to answer here. Not a lot of damage on that, but positioning is great. Tag the body again. Those add up. Those fierces on the bodies add up. Does he break? Oh, yeah, absolutely. He I mean, did nice. the counter break. Okay, this body this should be dead. There it is, Dan. Gender closes it out. Such a big position for Storm. That counter breaker is huge for the momentum. Yeah, the Sleep no longer has any assists there to help him out. So this is a pretty good spot for Sleep. Oh, man. It's, it is scary, though, right? He yeah. doesn't have assists to help him out, but he still has the jump. Medium kick as a threat. Didn't jump out of the shadow possession. That's a nice chunk of damage, actually, especially on Arya. Ooh, missed the air on Rose on again. And yeah, this is still the strength. You always got to be afraid. You can't go to the counter, which is the normal defensive option. Interrupted there. Caught him low. Instinct available for Hisako. Jumps the overhead. Instinct activation. Let's see what he's going to do. Oh, got he's going to get it. And that'll do it. Nice. Two games apiece here. Storm, a huge first life bar, which allowed yes. him to build on that momentum, close it out. When you don't have that base body, right, you don't have the ability to just float around in the air, wait all day, zone them out. It really hurts your chances in the matchup. You can see just Storm's face right now. Just like all of that patience finally paid off in that last game. And just the amount that that takes out of you. And hopefully you start off that next game just exactly. as strong, right? And sleep back to character select. 
it's such a strong matchup for him. I don't I don't know if we'll see him switch, but uh, yeah, this could just be like a momentum killer type right, thing, right? Just wait him out, yep. right? You got 30 seconds. Go yeah, back that's the character select. Yeah, I mean that's a thing that a lot of people don't think about too when it comes to tournaments like this. It's just like you just lost. Okay, I'm not gonna switch my character, but I will try to kill that momentum. Exactly. From the guy just that just waste beat me. the time. Yeah. Just get, give a second to think about it. Maybe. Oh, is there something I'm forgetting yep. in the matchup? Is there something I'm getting hit by a lot? I think it's a strong choice. And you get to change your color. And you get to change. Yeah. Your, yeah new paint job on Arya. Yeah. So here it is, two apiece here. Winner will move on into loser semis. That is top four of the tournament. Loser's out of here in fifth place, of course. Storm has had, a, I mean, both of these guys, really impressive pedigrees in this game, right? Yeah. Two of the most successful players to put their hands on KI, look for that early crouching fierce, went for the counter afterwards. And, and that's what, I feel like you gotta take risks like that if you are Storm, right? Oh, absolutely. Descent cancel. Try to catch him out of the air. Behind the back. Got the excitement going on. You, you keep calling it that. <laughs> Hard knockdown ender. I like the choice. The mix up here. Yeah, cross up air on Rio's on. And if he didn't break that combo, that was the body. And this is the start that Storm really needs. We saw this happen in the last game as well. Yeah, I wish. You know what I like is, yeah, I was going to say, I really wish he would threaten that wall jump maybe a little bit more, right? Mm. To maybe make sleep a little bit more uncomfortable. Back and off there. Yeah, that's gonna be a punish on the landing. Does he try to break? No, he did, and he got locked out for it. Another shadow on top. Ends the combo. Not enough to kill, but it's a lot. Empty low, maybe? No, he just goes for the another one. And then the float at the very end. Much better first body on this one than Sleep had last time. Yeah. Yeah, Storm needs to he needs to get in there. This is gonna be tough. Oh got couldn't do yeah. much about that there. Yeah, goes for the shadow. Shadow counter. Didn't even have to wait through the whole thing. I'm actually surprised he didn't try to counter that there. Off the shadow? Not going to go for it. Mm. Not going to happen. Yeah. She's not that privileged. <laughs> Would be nice, though. Yeah. For those who get through projectiles. Oh. So it's fine. Overhead caught him on the last bit. No break from sleep. Threatening that wall jump again, backing up a little bit. Air on reels on counter hit, so it's a recapture. Oh yeah, he got baited by yep. it. Second hit cancels early into the shadow. Instinct activation. <gasps> Missed the combo though, that was huge. But man, Hisako's life just draining here. This is one of those, it's such a bad position, right? There's, there's so little Hisako can do about these drones from full screen. Yeah, I mean, this is like the perfect storm right now for sleep. Just gonna wait it out. All right, tries to dash all the way in there. The shadow counter yep. again. Into ultra, that's gonna, gonna, gonna do it. 3-2 go. to Hollywood sleep over storm in loser's side. Storm goes home, fifth place here at Combo Breaker this year. Yeah, I mean, those were really, really good matches though. Very close matches, yeah. yeah. Like, and the, the thing about that is, you know, if Storm ended up getting that one more knockdown, right? Exactly. One knockdown, it would have knockdown, it changed the entire match. Yeah. That's what you can always expect. In a matchup like that, where you really need those one chance potentials to count, yeah. every knockdown, every mix up is so yeah. crucial, right? You really just have to make them count. Yeah. It makes some noise for Storm, everybody. Fifth place in the tournament here at Combo Breaker this year. Yeah. It, it's tough when you have a character that really hurts a lot of. What makes your character strong, right? Yeah, strong projectiles yeah. on uh, projectile properties on the normals. That's 